Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new video. So in this video, as you can see on the screen, we'll be reacting to Mr. Beast's newest video. Um, his last video was the world's most dangerous um, trap. I'll have to, I'm gonna react to that next video. But here is his latest video, which was literally two days ago. Number one on trending. Congrats, Mr. Beast. I think he even hit a world record for most views in an hour. I don't give a shit. Um, I wasn't talking about um. <laughs> wasn't talking about the world record. I was talking about the thing that popped up. But why is it still here? Oh my god! Get out of here, Epic Games. Anyways, let's get into it. This is a one hundred million dollar mega mansion, and it's possibly the most luxurious house. Hold on, I just got. I got a big sniff. Ever built go. by mankind, and we're gonna be comparing living in this house to living in this sixty-nine million dollar art house. You know, you get a from land sixty-nine, you know. That's built to withstand a literal tsunami. A what? A million dollar palace with its own water like, like, Woo! And everything in between, all the way down to this one dollar, barely functioning house. More of a shed. Well, it's only a dollar. Why does this house cost a dollar? Yeah, we get another storm. It's probably going to go into the water. Uh -huh. So it's worth a dollar for me to just to get rid of it. So you would say this is a horrible investment for me? Yes, indeed. Let's do it. Let's go! Oh, oh, this is sketchy. What are the odds I fall through? Pretty high. <laughs> Bro, these are wobbly. I like how that chair is just like holding on to her life. We have a recliner, a mattress, and half a floor. You can literally fish from inside of the house. Yo, I caught one. Whoa! That's just the lure, I'm sorry. Oh. So instead of eating like normal food, all you gotta do is just get a few fish in there and then you're all set, you know? <laughs> now that you see us having fun, do you regret selling it? I do not. <laughs> what if I give you $2 to buy it back off me? No. Alright, I tried. I have an idea. Let's get out of this house. Later in this video, we have a house that costs 100 million times Christ. more than this. And because I never plan on setting foot in this worthless shack again... Well, there, the there's one with a little you. nicer. Speaking of which, we're at the million dollar house. Which technically means you need to be a millionaire to buy this house. Let's show yeah. you how a millionaire lives. My first impression is it's way bigger than my house. When you pay a million dollars, huh? you get a pretty good sized kitchen, along with four bedrooms that look normal, but they keep going because this bedroom has a closet here, which leads into a bathroom that is bigger than a one dollar house. This to be honest, what I'm looking at right now is a kind of, it just looks like a normal house, to be honest. The bathtub is gigantic. I'm six foot five and I can fit in this perfectly comfortable. And even though the bathrooms are all stocked with bidets, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what do you do to it? For Chris. Oh, snap. They have a movie theater. Dude, oh, okay. Right, never mind. Keep what I said. This is not a normal house. Take what back what I said. Oh, just kidding. Wait, what? <laughs> These chairs each have two remotes. Two remotes. On top of the movie theater, there's also an arcade. Yeah, yeah, I take it back. I'm not expecting all these features for $1 million. Yo, the cool. arcade's in the kitchen? Oh, that's food. terrible. And ending with the pool, which comes complete with this unnecessary waterfall. You guys have been a fan of my channel for a long time. You know that I don't like small kitchens because they're shitty. This was a pretty fun house to live in. But of course, we're all here to see the richest of the rich. And that's yeah. why up next yeah. we have the 15 million... <clears throat> $15 million house. Some people just know there's a podcast about that. Are you listening to a podcast? So, um, well, from what they're looking like is, um... That one just looks like a normal house with some features added to it, so it's not that special. <laughs> oh my God. Maybe this one will be. Jeez, man. All right, yeah, this one's special. This, this one's like pretty special. The house that you try to get to in GTA. That view is crazy. The pool is much smaller than the one million dollar house, but you can literally oversee all of LA. All you need. Hold up. All you need. If your kid's crying in the pool, just throw them overboard. <laughs> Help! Hey! Hey! Stop, stop. Go inside. I need new friends. Let's check out the house. <laughs> the person who owns this house, what do you think he does for a living? Mm, NFT is... He's a lawyer. This guy was the top attorney in 2017 and the number one lawyer in what? 2021. Apparently that's all it takes to afford this house. It appears. Yeah, I want to be a lawyer or a debater in the future, so that's pretty big advantage to me. What the hell? I don't care about no Windsor. Dear Mr. Beast, thank you for visiting my home. 
You have given me the ultimate gift. I have a trump card with my kids forever. Aww. Also, please don't eat any of the sandwiches. They are very sacred to me, and my family's been passing it down from generation to generation. Got it. Down or up? Down. Down to this. Okay, now it's starting to look nice. The lower floor of this mansion comes with its very own movie theater Ooh. and personal gym. This treasure Whoa. requires the passcode. That would be in that gym all the time. I just I hate to break it, but I would. Six nine. It's not six nine six nine. A guest bedroom, entertainment area, and a bar where the owner left us a bunch of free food. Guys, before you eat anything, yeah. What if he left this out so he could sue us for eating his? Well, too late now, Carly. And an incredible <laughs> underground view of the swimming pool. Yeah! Woo! Nolan. I can already see people doing weird stuff with that. <clears throat> Trying to swim in the background for the shot. I don't think you realize we stopped filming it. Back here? Yeah, do it one more time. And now, a master bedroom with another crazy view. Carl, come in. You missed. We got another one. Why you missed again? Oh, wait, no, stop it! No, exactly. Stop See, just take your baby and throw it off the roof. If it goes over the edge, he might sue me. And so, to avoid being. <laughs> what do you mean? You already threw it. In there. This is looking like a school. Oh, Jesus Christ. In the main house, there are multiple living rooms, but this one is the best of the living rooms in this property. Holy this is grand. Hell. What is this? The Oval Office. What book would you expect here besides The Way to Wealth by Benjamin Franklin? Who made the light bulb and a book? Well, Edison made the light bulb, not Ben Franklin. What the hell is Ben Franklin? Do you want to read this book? <laughs> The living room and the office was the <laughs> what is kitchen, where the owner had left a little gift for us. The owner of this place got rich making candles, so he made us custom Mr. Beast candles. That one smells like the beach. It does. How do they put the beach in a candle? And to top off the house's main building, Chandler discovered that she can pick golf balls off the roof. Or, but that's not even close to the coolest thing about this place, because next door is a garage filled with exotic cars. Mm -hmm. It's like a garage out of a video game. They got Lamborghinis Hell. on top of Lamborghinis. It's like a candy store for adults. And the best part is, oh. this is just one of two car garages. Follow me. There's more. Two, Bro, there's more? more cars in here than the other one. Holy crap. All right, now I am convinced Hell yeah. if we steal a Hell car, yeah. you would not notice. Steal even... each and every one of them. Done. I Take them on. Hey, video's over. It's not even a full-time job to buy this many cars. There's stairs in the corner. I robbed the building. Go. Bro, this is like a closet with cars. Underneath the car garage is another army of cars. They should really invest in a light switch down here. They I'm waiting for that one house that has a full military tank, all right? I'm waiting for it. I have 20 cars down here, but no light. <gasps> no way. No. Oh, no way. What? shove 30 cars in their basement but not electricity now don't get me wrong all of the rooms in this house have been awesome so far but if i owned it i don't think i would ever leave this next building this is awesome that's right for some just ungodly reason whoever built this place thought it would be a good idea to install an entire indoor tennis court i just want to remind you that we are playing tennis inside a house I also have no idea how to play tennis. Huh. Gang squad, follow me. What? No way. Oh, hell yeah. Two story arcade. The arcade in this house is actually 20 times bigger than the one in the $1 million house. Whoa, but that's not all. Bro, this place literally has everything. Uh -huh. right, I'm never leaving. We're playing ping pong in a basketball court in a house. <laughs> First try, baby. All the features of the $30 million house have been pretty cool, but this next room is what makes this place truly special. Head up these stairs for the best part of the estate. What you really want to see is right over here. Look at this. This is an indoor water park. Whoa. It's like a whole other world in here. Look how far back the drop. What in the hell? What the what do you need all these tables for? Who are you inviting over? Bonus, and it's still going. Go have fun, but don't break anything. Roger that. <laughs> We're all about to go down the slide together. We're going to enjoy the water park. I'll see you at the...
Never heard of this type. <laughs> Ever. Imagine we got a little distracted. Ah, Jimmy won't make it. Buckets. <laughs> no, just steal it from Carl. Hit that. No shot. We got the. Who the hell is that? Yeah. Yes. Go, 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 go. Easy layup, bud. Yeah. There we go. Next boy wins. All you. Get it. 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 Get not worth it? Because it's Brentwood, that's probably half of it. Is Brentwood what that is? No. <laughs> the neighborhood. <laughs> I also thought he was talking about the wood in the house. <laughs> that's funny. This bathroom over here is nice. Do you have a couch in your bathroom? Yes. Oh, really? Yes. yes. Okay. We need to get on Mark's level. The number one rule is you have to have a heated seat. That's it? That feeling when you sit down and you go... Why the hell is it square? <laughs> I agree. You don't need to make billions to be happy. You just need to be able to afford a bidet. <laughs> And a heated toilet seat. <laughs> well, even though I'm sure Mark would love to spend more time here on the toilet, our time here has officially ran out. So, I'll see you guys at the next ah. house. Up next, we have a house whose price point happens to be a funny number. And now we are at the... Yeah, uh, yeah it, do it, do it does happen to be a funny number. Um, also, this... Is this a part of it, too? Because if not, this is not 69. Does look villainous. Really? Your house, this right? is it? <laughs> it's a lot bigger than mine. <laughs> Who the hell are you? Why do you look familiar? The reason why this weird Dude, why does she look familiar? I don't know why. Who does? It's because it's built to the brim with priceless art and sculptures sourced from all around the world. Oh, come on, dude. That one, that, that one girl that they, that they were showing, she was familiar. I don't know where from, but just somehow. And why the hell is that couch right side up? World. Throw up how much these artworks are worth, and we're gonna try to guess it. How much do you think this is worth? I'm gonna say a hundred thousand. What do you think, Miranda? I'm gonna go with eighty. Oh, she has one of these in her house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Only oh, you know the actual price. Oh wait, actually, this one will be a fun one. I'm gonna go with a million dollars because it's like right down the opening stairs. So. Uh, four hundred and fifty thousand. Very precise. Very specific. <laughs> the thirty million dollar house had a water park, a hundred cars. This place just has artwork. Big red sculpture thing. This room over here, we promised them 30 times we wouldn't touch what's in it. Come over here. Well, what's in it? What is it? This is a one-of-one, -one fully analog, custom home sound system. Made by the creator of the Walkman, which was one of the first devices that allowed you to listen to music while walking. That's an impressive thing to have under your belt, to made the Walkman. I don't think you could fit this under your belt. <laughs> Let's traverse across the skywalk. Oh my god, I'm excited. Another reason why this house is built so strange, for example, having to walk across sky bridges to get anywhere, is because it's been meticulously built to be able to withstand the force of a real tsunami. I mean, you gotta admit, that's pretty cool. Wow. You can see the tsunamis before they hit your house and you stop them. <laughs> what completes the view is uh, the neighbor's backyard. You can see all of it. What if the man who lives here is secretly in love with this person? <laughs> Ex-girlfriend. <laughs> it's a Romeo and Juliet. And after checking out the last two rooms inside, I had a surprise waiting for us outside. Look over there. What? These nuts. <laughs> oh Did you guys God. even notice the planes drawing that? No. Of course I did that at 69, you know. I paid these planes and also bought a thousand billboards all across America to let everyone know that Feastables is the best tasting chocolate you can buy. Stop eating Hershey's and other Boomer brands. Feastables is modern chocolate. Also, because <laughs> Halloween's coming up and all these retailers you see here, we're now selling these bags of these smaller Feastables bars so you can give them out during trick-or-treating. If you don't want to be lame on Halloween, make sure you give away Feastables to trick-or-treaters. <laughs> well, if how he's buying his own brand, so pretty much when he's buying his own you know, food that he makes. He's buying it and then just giving it back to him. And
and someone of their company, so it's like. The most luxurious hell? house on the planet, Mega Mansion. This massive 36,000 square foot mansion has things you'd never see in any other house. From a nightclub to a T Rex to what? an entire robotic car. Elevator, hell yeah. This place is going to blow your mind. And to make this house tour a little extra special, we brought Justin Timberlake. How you guys doing? And this is Justin's house. <laughs> no. <laughs> Holy crap. Rap. Have you ever seen a view better than this in your life? This is gorgeous. Yeah, man, you guys really, the CGI is perfect. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, maybe it's top ten. I, I'd put it top five. It's hard to describe just how big this mansion really is. It has 12 bedrooms and 17 bedrooms well? split across three massive stories. All with a perfect view of the Los Angeles skyline. I always judge a house by the kitchen. Minimalist kitchen. You judge these things, how are you feeling? Um... Well, Leave he and I don't give a shit. At the end of the tour, we'll get his opinion get on if you'd pay $100 get the fuck million. Away. He has it on standby if he likes it. <laughs> Straight cash, homie. Everything in this house is built out of the most expensive materials on the planet. For example, the walls in this room are constructed entirely out of rare marble imported straight from Italy. You guys gotta get an Holy estimate shit. or something of how much marble is actually in this house. I mean, that's a, that's like custom done. Yeah, there's not a single thing of drywall in this entire house. Yeah. Drywall? <laughs> It's a pretty sick chandelier. This chandelier is over a million dollars, and the ceiling literally started dipping because it weighs so many thousands of pounds. It really keeps going. You didn't tell me it was a million. I was playing with it earlier. There's literally six million dollars of just chandeliers in this house, and the rooms on the bottom floor get even better. There's a whole Dude, I love the house T-Rex man. Hello. You come over here. Dude, this is literally an ice room. Is this where you lock me in? <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> yep. So, like, what are you doing here? Of room ideas. Probably a 50% chance we're locked in here because that doesn't have a handle. Oh no, we're good. That would have been oh, funny if we were. Oh, his face. <laughs> Is that a real dinosaur? Now that you know the house has a dinosaur, are you more apt to buy it? I'm still on the fence. <laughs> What? This is a locker room? No one currently owns this house, so they put name tags of the few people on the planet that can actually afford it. Warren what? Buffett's worth like 80 billion, Ellison's worth like 50 billion, Bezos like 100 billion. Chandler, why is your name not up here? Oh. Alright, hmm? let's check out the whips. No, no, you just posing. I'd be sitting here. Oh, yeah, really the house. Thank you. I was, I was going for that. Yeah. I was going for that. Job well done. No one's gonna go in the editing room and clip that. <laughs> This $2.5 million dollar car elevator is one of the most insane elevator? in the whole Wait, what? Basically, you select which yeah, tell me a minute the process. Tablet, and it literally sends it up two floors right into the garage. I know what you're thinking. The main problem with this Hell is yeah. it only stores six Lamborghinis. Yeah. Yeah. Right you needed like a, a 10 car storage. <laughs> right. This house also had by far the biggest home theater I've ever seen in my life. Whoa. Whoa. This almost looks like a real movie theater. This is the best movie theater so far. And they're actually yeah, reclining man. chairs. It only costs 100 mil for that. <laughs> Check it out, Jimmy. Wait, what's the press my button? Oh, yeah. <laughs> It gives time. drama though. It is, exactly. It's a very it gives a dramatic effect. Holy shit, that's a I big screen. It's a little bit of a flex. What a gorgeous view of LA. <laughs> yeah, imagine if the screen 
favorite was LA? I think it is. it is. There's downtown LA, and there's downtown LA. For reference, Carl's like six foot five. Yeah, something like that, give or take. And look how tall the TV is compared to. All right, Justin. You've seen the so it's like, house. what, 12? Obviously, you have $100 million in cash sitting outside. Right. Are you going to buy the house? No one's shirt comes with it. You don't like my shirt? Your shirt comes with it? Yes. I'm in. Does, yes. does, does the bear that ripped up the shirt come with it? <laughs> <laughs> no one just got humiliated. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you around. To buy the house you just saw, check out 1200 huh? Bel in Los Angeles. We, I'm not going to buy it. What do you think I am? Bill Gates?